All right, number 14, where y'all at? Eric Bain. Eric Bain will be in the left lane racing the Axeman. All right, number 15, where y'all at? There we go, Giuseppe Gentile oh! versus Ryan. A matchup from last night. The finals from last night are happening in round one right here. It is the same race they raced last night for $40,000 is going down round one. Number 16, where y'all at? Reaper versus Dominator. Where's number 17 at? Chuck Parker racing out of the 405, racing Lizzie Musi, nitrous on nitrous. You see it's sunny, right? Number 18. <laughs> Thank you. You ready? Well, what do we draw? It's the same guy that we raced last night. The it's like a rematch, but in the daylight. Yeah, in the same lanes and everything. There's so, uh, a little more heat today and some wind. I think the track will be better. Yeah. So, you know, what I'll say is we know how to outrun him, but he's going to, you know, he's going to try to improve his car. Right. Giuseppe Gentile and myself were getting ready to race the finals for Maryland, and then the rain came through. It wouldn't let up, so we ran the race here in Epping, New Hampshire. Yeah! I won that race and the 40 grand. But today, who else do I pull first round? None other than Giuseppe Gentile. You know, I know what Giuseppe's thinking right now, and he thinks he's getting a second shot to try to outrun me. He's going to try to use some of his data to figure out that he needs to go faster, but you know what? That ain't going to happen. All right, everybody stand up. It's going to be a good ride. Here we go. All right, everybody stand up. It's going to be a good ride. Ryan Jake is up and Here we go. Thanks, man. man. Hey, Thank awesome you. betting with you. Awesome Thank betting you. with you. Thank you. Appreciate awesome you betting with you. you. Thanks, you. man. It's your Ryan. Damn it. I think you left on me good, too. Oh. Pissed off. Pissed. But it's all right. I mean, it's part of it. And uh, yeah, I'm mad when it's my when it's my fault, when I, when I don't do my job. I got to cut a good light. And you know, the team does all their stuff. So yeah, I'm definitely uh, pissed off. Because I'm normally consistent. It doesn't happen often that that I sleep on the tree and get beat, so. And I'm telling you, I let go and the car just didn't go. It did not go. Oh yeah, it was bad. Same right there for day. I think that's probably a better pass too. Yeah. No, but I think the data that we used from last night was really a big help for today. I think the track's a little bit better. I don't think it's any better up top, but I think in the middle and down low, it's a little bit better. I think my light was a little bit better. All right, so. Off to round two. We don't know who we got. All right, well, let's do our thing on this. I'll do my thing on the keyboard. And we'll see who we get. Just be careful. I know you've been up all night long, you know? It worries me. It always worries me. I'll be tired clear up until I set the, the train brake and it's on the chip, and then True. it's going to be all good. But we make sure and treat it, right? I found a boost leak. So I've literally been up since 6.30 yesterday morning to pull both heads off, clean the surfaces, beg somebody to give you head gaskets that you don't even know, put it all back together, and try and be on the starting line for the first round. I drew Reaper. I've got my job cut out for me. First round, of course, I draw Dominator. The last person I want to draw the, the one guy with probably as bad luck as I've had. Two days of thrashing on it, no passes whatsoever, and we come to the No Prep Kings to try to race. I'm not here to play team stuff. I am here to win a championship. Got him at the finish. That was cool for a minute. <laughs> uh, 
go get some money. Where are you? 17th pair. Okay, and good. And we got, we got Lizzie. I've only raced her one time. Arizona, we drew her, I outran her. As long as history repeats itself, we'll be good, guys. Hey, we got her. At this race here, we got our new car. We know we've got power, but we're having a hard time making the car go A to B. We're gambling that she's not going to make a complete good pass, so uh, we're going to see what will happen. What about Chuck 55? He's got a brand new car. He's only got three runs on it. Yeah, take your time. Do your job as a driver. I'm going to do my normal deal on there. No, you never know. I mean, he's, he's a contender, but you don't have no time with the car. That's my thing. Yeah. All right. That's fine. All right. Good luck. Got this. I love you. First round, I drew Chuck 55. I knew they had a new car, and they were struggling to get down the track. But uh, anything can happen. You know, any in a race, anything can happen. They can go out there and run and kill a run for the first time with a new car, you know? So you just got to be on your game. My clothes are good. Round one, we pulled Chuck 55. Last year, we were struggling so bad with aftershocks. It never made a straight run. If we go out there 330 feet and break loose. Going into this race, I'm, I'm excited, because now my dad's on board, and he's coming along, helping us with the motor. And on top of everything, Team NOLA, we're working together as a team, and we couldn't ask for anything better than that. <laughs> she takes the first bulb, I take the second bulb. It's a stall game. She's trying to get in my head. I'm gonna play her game. She finally stages, I drill her on the tree. About 3.30, she starts coming around me. She puts a link on me at the end. We're looking forward to the next race because we're gonna swing for the fence on the next one. I made a killer hit, did my job on the tree. It was a major burn down between me and him. Beginning of the day, we wanted as many NOLA guys as possible to stay in this race, and that's what's working out right now. Scott's moving on to the next round, Kai's moving on to the next round, and I'm moving on to the next round. When we're working together as a team, it, it works out that way.